I would like to welcome Pitch Professor, and he's the king of the startup scene, Daniel Crane. Since social mobility is becoming the new normal, quicker than ever. It's a fascinating thing. Sometimes these crazy ideas of today, they'll be the normal, the reality of the future. But imagine how many times they heard, this will not work, or that's impossible. Smart people said this. Or my absolute favorite sentence is, no one has ever done that. <laughs> Which, in essence, isn't this the definition of innovation? Innovation means doing something new. And doing something new, well, new things sometimes don't work, right? Probably the first light bulb wasn't perfect. So that's the point. If we think of good old Thomas sitting there and he drew his light bulb, the first design probably wasn't perfect. So let's be honest. In my opinion, and I've been working with startups for many years, I think about 90% of startups fail. Early stage startups. That's high. 90%. They fail, but the thing is for me, is that a bad thing? No, I don't think so, because for me, a startup is based on a hypothesis. A guy called Mark, who has a startup called Facebook, said, we need to move fast and break things, and I love this sentence. You need to be brave enough to move fast and break things, but for this, you need one thing, and that's speed. No driver ever, ever wants to crash, but every driver understands in order to win, I have to accept that I might crash sometime. For me, the whole thing is about falling flat on your face 50 times and getting up 51 times. And I like to reference this as, let's call it, a culture of perseverance. That's, I think, something real, a culture of perseverance. I think we live in incredible times, and at times with tremendous opportunity, and especially fast times, speedy times. Now, think of this. If we look at the topic of social mobility, if you think how quickly you can suddenly start generating impact in times like these, it's extreme. Nowadays, what you need, you need to be crazy enough to do it. You need to be absolutely nuts enough to give it a shot. And, most importantly, don't have anyone ever, ever stop you. Because in my opinion, the only one who can stop you is you.